Hi madam, I am Bermas and my other two team members are Ruth Leti Fraser and Shira Alusias Asoy. We are from group HM11138 and uh, our preferred ground transportation company is Bus Asia Baramas and our proposed travel pass card is Kuching Tourist Pass Card. Our presentation will be covered on background of the company, services offered, website and mobile application, and for the proposed travel pass card, name of the travel pass card, travel pass card design, and concept of the travel pass card, and also the conclusion of our presentation. Hi, Madam. I am Bursilati Fraser from HM1113A. Um, today, I want to present about introduction, background of the company. So, Bus Asia is considered to be the best bus company in Malaysia. It is established in 1992 and one of the express bus brand under Piaramas Express has the largest fleet of buses and also has the most schedules of services for the routes between major cities in Borneo Island on daily basis. So here is services offered by Bus Asia for the physical transport. Seats are very comfortable with spacious leg room with extra space is provided to store the luggage. Bus coach is fully air conditioned. Also provide Wi-Fi. And there is various type of buses run by Bus Asia, Piorama, such as Super VIP, Sitter and Economy. For staffs, staff and drivers are experienced and well trained. Fleet management system also monitors driving behavior to ensuring the safety of passengers on board. For the system to purchase the tickets is using the app or website of Red Bus. As we can see, there is the general routes of Bus Ezra Baramas route and timings from Kuching to Cebu, also from Suryaman to Sarike, from Kuching to Simpang Bekenu, Tatau to Betong and Tebedu to Batu Lintang. So there is the timings. Hello, my name is Shira. Today I will like to present about my part on website and mobile application for the Bus Asia. Bus Asia has its own website and app uh, for um, customer to share the information of Bus Asia services. Red Bus mobile application has been developed to make um, the process of booking the ticket easier for customer. For the information provided, um, all the options available on the website are also available on the Red Bus app as well. Information about a bus ticket fare can be confirmed on the Red Bus Malaysia website. Uh, um, the customer also can look for the discount or offer on the ticket. For the usability of the website or mobile app, um, this website is very convenient procedure to travel with Bus Asia Biarama. Uh, you can log in to the Red Bus that my. Um, for the website or mobile apps, ability to book uh, and purchase online ticket. It is easy, convenient, and leave traveler having all their question answer by just browsing the website. Um, this um, website and app for the um, Bus Asia is uh, user friendly and offer a simpler way to book bus ticket online. For the safety and security, the Red Bus app and website host a safe and secure 
payment platform. That's all from me. Thank you. And for our proposed travel pass card, it is named as Kuching Tourist Pass because uh, this tourist pass is mainly on Kuching area. And this is our design, the front and the back of this travel pass card. For the concept and details of this uh, travel pass card that we are propose, firstly, the availability. Kuching Travel Pass will be made available on Kuching Town only. However, in the future, we are planning to make a greater coverage of this tourist pass to other areas in Sarawak as well. And for promotion, we are going to promote through three main medium, which is website, mobile application, and social media Facebook. For website, uh, it is named as www.kuchingtouristpass.com.ny While well, for mobile application as Kuching Tourist Pass And for Facebook as Kuching Tourist Pass Official Where all the information uh, including the term and condition of using this tourist pass card is available on uh, the three main media So for deduction per entry uh, it is based on uh, the transportation chosen by the tourists. For example, city public link bus usually costs two ringgit uh, if going to the city center. And how to use the card? Uh, tourists only need to tap the card on the machine card provided in the public transportation and other associated transportation uh, when uh, uh, visiting other places tourists are entitled to free admission to tourist destination that participate in the coaching tourist program uh, uh, beside Tourists only need to present the coaching tourist pass card at the entrance for confirmation. And this tourist uh, coaching tourist pass card can also be used for discount and other offers when shopping and at a restaurant, cafe, bistro, and entertainment venue in coaching. Next is the transportation that tourists can use by using the card. Um, major public transportation used around Kuching is bus, so that means uh, tourists will major use the bus. And other transportation that tourists can use with the card is Sarawak River Cruise. And for this cruise, tourists can only need to present their tourist pass card to the officers in charge. For marketing, we are using social media mainly to promote our Kuching Tourist Pass. We are on Facebook as Kuching Tourist Pass Official. By using social media to promote our Tourist Pass, it will help to grow our brand awareness because nowadays people are using social media uh, mostly in daily life and then how tourists can apply and purchase this card coaching tourist pass card can be purchased online through coaching tourist pass website and mobile application also through when in coaching through several coaching tourist pass sales center in and around coaching for foreign tourists they can purchase a uh, through the website and then for the price um, this pass card come in six variant it is mainly divided into two for adult and for children for day one uh, one day adult is 150 ringgit while one day children is 125 ringgit Malaysia. 
a three day adult is 250 ringgit and three day children is 225 ringgit and six day per adult is 450 ringgit and six day per children is 415 ringgit uh, tourists can choose which one is best suited for them through this six variant available next is attraction that can be visited using the card for your information tourists have free admission to this uh, attraction because this attraction are the one that participating with our travel pass card first Sarawak Kasha Village next Bako National Park Samango Nature Reserve Anahara is Longhouse, Jong's Crocodile Farms, and Borneo Hiren Resort. Tourists only need to present this card and a letter officer check for them and wait for the confirmation from the officers there and then tourists can freely enter this attraction. So, why coaching tourist parks can help promote the city, town, or town and local transportation? This is because this pass card become an adding value to tourist experience. In other words, uh, this will lead to uh, boost tourism products and service uses in the destination. Therefore, tourist expenditure will also increase. Besides, this tourist coaching pass, eh, coaching tourist pass will help to expose tourists to less known attraction and increasing the uses of public transportation. Besides that, tourists will likely to increase the length of stay in our country. And yeah, this will also have effect in increasing the repeat comeback to the same destination using this travel pass card in conclusion with bus asia biaramas ground transportation for the locals are made easier besides the advancement of technology has made it much more convenient and hassle free uh, such as for the payment of the bus ticket using the website and the mobile application and for Kuching Tourist Pass, it is being made to serve tourists that come to Kuching, Sarawak. Hopefully, the objective are being fulfilled. Um, so, in the future, there will be much improvement and changes based on the current trend being added to this Kuching Tourist Pass card. And besides, uh, we are planning to make much more coverage of areas that can be used with this tourist pass card. So to sum up, the transport industry has gained a vital place in the global network system and one of the most important components in the tourism infrastructure. That's all from us. Thank you.